The Earth, I have exciting news I want to share with you. What is it? Did we find a new super habitable exoplanet? Nope. The news I want to share with you is that you may be a Chthonian planet. Meaning? Most gas giants have a rocky core, right? A Chthonian planet is a planet that started as a gas giant. But because the planet's close proximity to its star, it gets more radiation, so it loses its hydrogen helium atmosphere. So what's left of the planet is its rocky core. This rocky core becomes what's left of the gas giants and becomes a planet. I was never a gaseous planet, let alone a gas giant. I was a lava planet and thanks to icy asteroids, I had water and supported life. That's it. Yeah, you're a bit delusional, Venus. The Earth, there is compelling evidence supporting Venus's claim. Let me explain. Hey everyone, Mama Jupiter is gonna tell a story about the Earth. Let's listen. In the realm of celestial formation, gas clouds condense to form planets. Gas giants typically form far from stars, rich in hydrogen and helium. But I do not remember that happening. I just remember that I formed from the inner solar system. Korat 7b and TOI 849b is an example of a Chthonian planet. It may have began as a gas giant, but its atmosphere got stripped away by stellar radiation, leaving a rocky core. Pretty sad that you went from gaseous planet to a rocky planet. I share something similar. I could have been as big as Venus if Jupiter didn't consume the mass around my area. But hey, at least you have complex life. My life forms don't treat me how I want to be treated. But you have us, Brother Terra. We are all proud to be part of your story. All of us think you're quite special. I admire your habitability, though I am sure that some of the moons or planets would like to be colonized, like the Galilean moons, or me. Perhaps knowing my past allows me to embrace my present. Now you're getting it.